Veterinary Dermatology. The Causes, Diagnosis, and Treatment of Pyoderma in Dogs. Pyoderma is a skin infection due to bacteria overgrowth. Pyoderma is sometimes known as impetigo, particularly in young puppies. The most prevalent clinical manifestation of pyoderma is the formation of papules or pustules on the skin. In humans, these lesions frequently resemble pimples. They are often red and elevated, with a pus-filled white center. Other clinical signs of pyoderma include circular crusts, dry or flaky patches of skin, hair loss, and itching. In addition, the coat of short-haired breeds may protrude or stand up in certain sections, like hives, or it may appear moth-eaten due to uneven hair loss. Pyoderma occurs when the skin's surface is broken, the skin is wounded from chronic exposure to moisture, the typical skin bacteria are altered or modified, the blood supply is hindered, or the immune system is repressed. Pyoderma is frequently a symptom of allergic dermatitis and occurs in abrasions on the skin's surface caused by scratching. Puppies often develop puppy pyoderma in parts of the body with sparse hair, such as the groin and underarms. In addition, fleas, ticks, yeast, or fungal skin infections, thyroid disease or hormonal imbalances, inheritance, and certain medications. Immunosuppressive medications such as azathioprine, cyclosporin, and higher dosages of steroids, may all increase your pet's risk of getting pyoderma. Pyoderma is diagnosed in one of two ways. The clinical indicators and medical history of your pet are frequently used to make a diagnosis of pyoderma. Additional tests may be conducted, including blood testing to evaluate whether your pet has an endocrine disorder, hypothyroidism or hyperadrenocorticism, skin cytology, skin culture, antibiotic sensitivity tests, and fungal cultures. In cases of allergic dermatitis, tests to detect your dog's specific allergens may be conducted. Pyoderma is often treated with antibiotics for a minimum of three to four weeks. It is critical to perform a skin culture and antibiotic sensitivity test in chronic or recurrent cases to ensure that the appropriate antibiotic is given. Pyoderma may require antibiotics for eight to 12 weeks in some instances. Antibiotics such as amoxicillin, cephalexin, and clindamycin are frequently used, although more resistant bacteria may need a medication such as enrofloxacin. The use of antibiotics for a minimum of three to four weeks is the standard treatment for pyoderma. Topical treatment options include ointments, sprays, and medicated shampoos containing benzoyl peroxide, sulfur with salicylic acid, or chlorhexidine, which should be applied one to two times weekly for three four weeks. Additionally, your pet's bedding should be clean, dry, and cushioned. In the case of pyoderma produced by allergies, antihistamines or low-dose steroids may be administered together with longer-term therapy. The majority of cases of pyoderma resolve with the administration of oral antibiotics and topical treatment. Chronic cases of pyoderma in dogs may require additional diagnostic tests to rule out the possibility of an underlying ailment causing the bacterial skin infection. Bathing regularly using medicated shampoos can help prevent recurrences. In the majority of instances, the prognosis for simple pyoderma is good to excellent. 